Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the SEO and Use series brought to you by Pro Lemon. All right, in today's video, I'm just going to show you a quick, real simple way of organizing and managing the quality of the service you're delivering for your clients and the overall timeline that you should be looking at. Okay, so first and foremost, what do I mean by this? Well, if you have or if you're starting out in SEO and you used to have five clients, all right? What would be smart for you is to dedicate a certain amount of time each day for each client or dedicate a client for each day. Now, this over here is just something you can pull and use, all right? It has the site, which is basically going to be example.com. Uh, what kind of service you're giving to them? Are you developing their website? Are you using, uh, are you just doing SEO? What are you doing for them, all right? That's what this column is for. And then the rest of these are going to be for basically monitoring the website's health, okay? So for example, um, the GSC, if you know their website, is it going up, is it trending downwards, or is it neutral, right? It's a good way to catalog the amount of changes you're doing to a website and keep everything in a good order. Uh, GA4, if you have Google Analytics 4 set up, what are the general trends on there? Is it trending upwards, is it trending downwards, is it neutral? Are you just at your normal balance? Are you still in a positive mindset? Whatever comment you want to put in there, put that in there. The SEO score, like if you're doing all-in-one SEO, Yoast, Rank Math, what's the general health of the website? Give a number here, give an A, a B, a C, a D, anything like that. Just make sure that you put a general markup here to ensure that, you know, you can say, okay, this is what it looks like on, day, on week one. This is what it looks like on week four. GTX Matrix, you can either use this or um, Lighthouse, like I showed you guys earlier. In general for this, it's just good to have two different points of reference. I know both use Lighthouse. Uh, well, G GT Matrix uses Lighthouse, but I just like using both. Sorry about that, guys. Um, so then we also have AdSurf. Basically, what are they looking like on AdSurf in terms of their site health? Same with SEMrush. You can use either one or both if you'd like. This is basically the Lighthouse performance metric. You can use um, SiteLiner for duplicate content, or you can actually check the website. How, what is my percentage of duplicate content? And then finally, the link checker. How many broken links do I have? There's plenty of tools out there you can use. You can use Link Checker, you can use Doctor Link Checker, whatever you'd like to use. Okay. So in general, and I know I'm flying through this really, really quickly, but I want to keep this one nice and short. In general, what we're looking for is a good balance for the health of the website. All right. And basically what you're going to do is you're going to set a time, okay, every week, every two weeks, every third day, however long, you're just going to duplicate the sheet and go through this every single day for your clients or your website, or whatever else, to keep a track and backlog of seeing this is what's working, this is what isn't, and managing your time and data. Something that I'm really starting to learn as well as I mature in my SEO journey is that managing time and managing data is super important. So it's super important that you guys do that correctly. Thanks so much. If you have any questions, please drop them down below and I'll see you tomorrow.